Hey everyone, what is going on? This is Hydroxidant, and welcome to week three of our draft league battles. This week we have to overcome a monumental task. We have to beat a mountain. By that I mean it's Gigantamax Snorlax. We have to beat Gigantamax Snorlax, and I don't, I don't think I can. Um, in two weeks, uh, on this person's team, they have about five kills uh, with it. So, yeah. <laughs> That is, it's really going to be hard for us to, to deal with. Uh, we're going to do our best, obviously. We're going to rock on. You'll see who we got once we connect in. I'm not too sure. They have a lot of good Pokemon on this team. And I 100% could have brought the wrong team, you know? Um, that's the one thing about Draft League is you never really know for sure what they're going to bring against you. Uh, it's... So we'll see, you know? We will surely find out. Um, once we connect, uh, so just a quick rundown of their roster. They have Gigantamax Snorlax, they have Grimmsnarl, they have Galarian, Corsola, Chandelure, Arachnoid, Espeon, Mudsdale, Selgor, Barbarical, and Grappaloct. Um, so that it's... Uh, it's going to be pretty monumental to overcome. So we're going to do our best for sure. Well, we will see how this goes once we connect in eventually. I should just do like Wolf's like hour long. Obviously Wolf quick. Uh, Let's see what I'm talking about. Wolf's like hour long intros. Is this Ryan? It is. Okay. We are connected. And, uh. I'll decide myself, I guess. Uh, the last few weeks, um, we've been doing. Uh, this one, I guess? Yeah. <laughs> I can't remember. All right, participating team. This is where we bring the fire. By that I mean we're not. We don't have a single fire type. Um, G Max or Beetle. We have my boy, my little fish, Quillfish. We have Weavile, Girder, Dracozolt, and Whimsicott. We're gonna hope to do our best. So I on so I know each week I've been saying like oh I don't I think this is the one we lose but this one uh, I don't think I have a good matchup against them. Oh buddy, this is not the team I wanted to see. Okay, who do I lead against these guys? Okay, so the issue I have right away is. Espeon. I need to hear to Espeon somehow. Okay. Quillfish might be too much of expected of a lead, so I'm gonna actually lead Weavile. So, we'll see. Um, I'm hoping they lead either Espeon uh, or something. You know? A Selgor. I really should have expected a Selgor. Not the best lead for me. Um, he's gonna get... He is going to get up. Suffer free here. Ugh. I made a mistake. I think I need to swap already. Went to what? I don't really have a great swap, and I guess we're just going to stay in and foul play. Yeah, bug bus. Eh, that was a bad move by me. Ooh, buddy. Okay. Yep. What is that? Throat spray. 
Ugh. I don't really have a counter this thing, which is super duper unfortunate. I made already the biggest mistake I could have. Um, yeah, losing Wii Volley was so bad here. So we're just going to Outreach. Uh, I predict the switch into Mudsdale. Or they're just going to get um, spikes up. So we'll see what they choose to do. Mudshot. It has Mudshot. That's crazy. And I just lose him, actually, because I'm Outrage. That's annoying. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's bad. That's not great. Not great for Tony. Yep. Ah. Uh. Yep, yeah, we just lose him here. Well, he has Prankster. Yeah, we're confused now. Alright, we have to try to swap him out to try to keep him for later. Um, this is one of the two reasons you're here, Wimsicott. That does a lot. Holy crap. That doesn't do nearly enough. Man, I'm getting absolutely demolished. Leftovers? Yeah. That's bad. Okay. So, we just lost. I don't have anything to be, uh... <sighs> Mudsdale now. Unfortunately. So what else do they have? Yeah, dude, this is bad. Um... So... There's a huge shot they switch into Espeon. They don't switch into Espeon. That's crazy, man. Then we get the poison. Cool. We're going to protect... Rest! Oh, goodness. Alright, we're putting Toxic Spikes up this turn. Absolutely genius.
this setup, uh, this Grim Snarf setup is amazing. It's gonna play rough again, right? Because I think play rough is its only attack move. Rest, oh, so it's so, okay. That strategy is so good. This is kind of what we have to do now to whittle this thing down, is just keep poison jabbing, I think. Because I'm really running out of ways to get rid of this thing. That's a crit. 100% crit. Thank you, Quillfish. Okay, so now, um, I think Espeon comes in, right? Damn, losing Weavile. I needed to switch Weavile out that first turn. That's so bad that I didn't. Ah, oh, man. So, unfortunately, I think they get a calm line up for free, right? I can't really do anything about it. I need to get Quillfish out of here, try to save it. No, they just, they just went for the attack. I'm surprised. Yeah, I think Max Flutterby here is my best bet. I gotta try to nuke this thing, get it out of here. <sighs> Cause right now we're 4-4. Four, four. It's probably gonna be faster though, right? So you're gonna have Shadow Ball? Oof, that's such a big live. And it critted anyway. What is that? Lower spdef. Oh, is this a life orb? A spam? Okay. It's not great that we straight up die though. Like we just pretty much are gonna lose our orbital. I, yeah, I think there's a lot of things coming against us at the end. Yeah, Snorlax. Snorlax being poisoned is nice. Um, however... I think we just have to do as much chip as we can. I don't... Is Snorlax going to be faster than Orbeetle? So I think it belly drums anyway, right? Yeah, it didn't... Check in the max, so belly drum. Does belly drum increase speed? It's just attack, right? So the only thing we have going for us is if somehow we are able to take this thing out right now. Yeah, so I have a play in my head. Alright, so GMAX Gravitas does not take Snorlax out. The play is, we gotta hope that this move doesn't kill. Well, no, so Snorlax is gonna kill here. Um, but we have to hope that we can just stall 
Sulex out somehow. Like if Or Beetle gets this kill, we this is amazing. No, I'm not even close. That sucks. Does he find the berry though? Him not finding a berry would be huge. I don't think he found a berry. Amazing. Okay. So... The reason you're here, <laughs> sweetie, <laughs> is ex this exact moment. <laughs> um... No reason we just don't drain punch. Got Girder. Snorlax. One. So now they have Shandalor and Mudsdale, I think, left, right? Yeah, and I have not a great time. So, man, I have to like get super lucky here. Ugh, not enough. Yeah. We had to do way more. Okay. Oh, man. Yeah, I honestly, we just have to hope for a high damage roll, I think. No. The defense keeps coming up, too. So, yeah, Quillfish comes in. I, I have to hit protect, right? Like, I can't whisk, risk, um, you know what? Uh, yeah, I can't risk, um, let's still be faster, so. We were in a 2v1. Uh, I, I really do see a way we lose. And it's this chandelure <laughs> setting up Trick Room. We have liquidation. We gotta hope this does a lot. Does so much. Quillfish, you beautiful Pokemon, you. Quillfish is the best little Pokemon ever. Fish gets Chandelure. And we get the W. Nice. Um, yet again, did not think we would be able to pull that one off. 
Um, quillfish absolutely coming in clutch. Um, we won 2-0 there. We only have two mons up, but quillfish absolutely did everything for us that game. So I think we have to just love our quillfish god here. So thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, please leave a comment about how much you love quillfish. <laughs> leave a subscribe if you love quillfish. Uh, <laughs> and I will catch you